Yo, how's it going people and welcome back to my channel. I'm back again, right, in this video, yeah. Before I have seen my next video will be about obviously the match preview of Arsenal vs Bournemouth, yeah. In this video it's all about the one and only who has really, really been scoring most goals already, who has always wanted to be scoring every single time, you know, who's always wanted to be scoring, yeah, that they signed for 65 million pounds before the start of this season. Kai Havertz, yeah. Kai Wizardry Havertz, man. My guy. Big up to your damn self, yeah. And I can't lie, yeah. This guy yeah, that likes to be scoring in most Arsenal games now, even towards the final season, I am over the moon. And I'm nearly speechless, but I can say a few things about Kai Havertz. He is really, really cooking. I'm telling you, man, something. He is really, really cooking because if, if you look at how he was terrible at the start of the season, if you look at the tactics, the way he played at the start of the season, when he couldn't track back, couldn't defend, couldn't pass, couldn't run. He didn't do anything that time. We as fans wanted him out. Some fans said, give him a chance. Give him a chance. But I gave him a chance and then he did improve. I remember he, I remember him scoring a goal in his debut against Bournemouth. Yeah, away at Bournemouth. That's one thing I remember. He saved the day at Brentford at the GTech Community Stadium. You know. Uh, the way he's been scoring yeah, in like, you know, some of these Arsenal games already, yeah, that he even wants to be scoring in most games, which is what I've seen. Havis is really cooking. I know some a lot of people didn't even like him. Even me, I didn't like him. But people even criticized me for criticizing Havis because I thought he was shit, but he's improved. He's improved. 65 million pounds was a lot. And I thought it would have been wasteful if he was still a shit player by now. But and so... He, I don't think he should leave my club after all, yeah? You man, don't be against me for criticising Havertz because Havertz has really improved. 60 million down the drain, Kai Havertz scores again. And if not, this guy is really, really cooking. And I'm telling you, the way he's scoring goals in most games can even help us to win this league, yeah? 60 million down the drain, Kai Havertz scores again. Zamina, mina, eh, eh, waka, waka, eh, eh. 60 million down the drain. Guy have scores again. I love this guy, bro. Yeah, I love what he's doing. Every time. Always wanting to be scoring. And I'm happy that Mikel Arteta is now starting him nowadays now in the Arsenal game. I'm really happy because and I can't lie, he should start him till the end of the season. If he does that, guy, you just know Kai will be scoring. You know? I've never ever for once in my life seen him score at Emirates. And I tell you man something, yeah. I want to see that. Yeah, I'm, I I just think, I'm, I mean, I booked my ticket. I'm going to be at the Arsenal vs Bournemouth game. I mean, let's just hope I get in and I'll let you man know that I'll be Amherst. But until then, yeah, if I go, have it to score. Please have it. Do score for me. I want to see you score. Yeah, I, I love what you do. All that 60 million, 60 million down the drain. You score all the time. That's what I want to see. Yeah. Kai wizardry habits, always running up to try and score is what I always love to see. Always in the right position is all I want to see. So, has Havertz, has Havertz improved? Yes or no? Yes, he's improved. He's actually improved that. I've got no problem with Havertz. I'm not saying he's shit, rubbish, directed, and I'm not saying any of that. He's improved and he's improved. None of that, you know, I'll say, oh, the, like, you know, I shouldn't, shouldn't assign him. I can't lie. Arteta... Uh, it's lucky to see this guy doing well now that I bet him and the him, him and the owner, the board, will have nothing, you know, personally wrong with Kai Havertz because he's really improving well in Arsenal Football Club. Because I tell you something, when he left Chelsea Football Club, he left Chelsea Football Club for a reason because he knew Chelsea were absolutely poor last season, yeah? Even how they're poor now, I doubt Chelsea will even qualify for the Conference League. But apart from that, yeah, he knew that Chelsea would do absolutely poor, yeah? Yeah, that they bought today against Manchester United, yeah, last season in the league. That that's the reason why he left because he was tired that Chelsea were playing shit, you know, last season. Sorry for sorry for that. Do forgive me, but to be honest with you, mate, it's a good thing that he even left. It's a really good thing that he left because he came to the right place. He understands that we are by far the greatest team in London. We win games more than any other team like Chelsea. Yeah, so he came to the right place, as in the right club to be playing for, as in Arsenal Football Club. Yeah, he came to the right spot because, as I speak, yeah, as I speak, look at the way he scored against his old team. Two goals against his old team is the most craziest thing I ever seen in my life, and I, I was like, Jesus Christ, this guy scored against his old team. But at least he didn't celebrate because that that his his Chelsea fans were watching him at the Emirates, you know. 
scoring against his old team because he knew that Arsenal are better than Chelsea, of course. We are by far the greatest team in London. You know what they say. London is red. And is London red? Always. It will always be red. London will always be red wherever we Arsenal fans go. And with Kai Havertz, London is red. I'm telling you. Kai Havertz that scored against Chelsea, I was shocked. I was even speechless. I couldn't even say a word that day when he even scored. All I can say is was Kai wizardry habits. That's all I can say. When I mean wizardry, a guy that can move move anyhow. Moving like a wizard to try and run up a score is crazy, you know. But I'm telling you something, yeah. With Kai Havertz starting, it's really going good now. He's cooking and I'm telling you, if he does that to end of the season, I tell you, Kai Havertz will be one of the top players. As he's beginning to be that. Because how he runs up the score, he knows when to track back now. I love to see that. So, that's the Kai Havertz that I want to see. That in my main bit about this Kai Havertz has really cooked up towards the final season. Yeah, he came to the right club because he knew when he when he was dead at the start. But we asked for us criticize him because we asked for us really want this club to actually we really win this league title. Yeah, we we want to win this league, and that's why we wanted Kai Havertz to be the best, and it has happened. Kai Havertz, big up to your damn self. And I want to see more of that tour the last game of the season. Anyway, thank you, my for watching this video, yeah? You know what to do if you haven't subscribed. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Follow my socials here. The link in the description below. You know what to do. But yeah, that's it for now. I will see you in my next vid. Come on, you gunners. And bye for now.